Hey guys, Funk Roberts from FunkMMA.com, FunkRobertsFitness.com, and today I'm always excited, but extra excited to bring you double kettlebell metabolic workout, baby. This is gonna be tough, this is gonna be awesome. Again, burning fat, building muscle, explosiveness, everything you want in a workout to get you in amazing shape, get you amazing endurance, and of course, burn fast, like I just said. I'm a little bit tired because I just finished this workout, but I wanna show you this. So basically we're using two kettlebells, double kettlebell, and we're doing five exercises. We're doing each exercise, 30 seconds of work followed by 30 seconds rest, one after the other. So we've got that metabolic feel to it so we can burn calories during and after. Plus the exercises are um, uh, hybrid exercises. So you're gonna see two movements in one exercise. So again, building muscle, strengthening our body, and getting the best shape of our life. Anyway, I wanna take you through this workout, but make sure you stay tuned after because I'm gonna give you something free at the end of this video. But right now, let's get to the workout. Let's get it done. Perform each exercise for 30 seconds of work, followed by 30 seconds rest, one after the other, with no rest in between. After you're done, all five exercises, rest for one minute and repeat for five total rounds. Guys, let's get it done. Okay, our first exercise, our bridge chest press with the kettlebell. So basically we put our body into a bridge, core's tight, hips are up, and then we're doing alternating kettlebell presses. So I'm using 45 pounds, 55 pounds here. So you wanna go pretty heavy, and you wanna focus on alternating the kettlebells, one after the other, pressing above your eyes. It's really important to keep your glutes tight, core tight during this exercise. Squeeze those glutes, hips are up, and you're breathing throughout. You're gonna really start to feel this uh, closer to the 30 second mark for sure. My next exercise here are kettlebell cleans to reverse lunge. So again, we're combining exercises, a power exercise with the kettlebell clean. We rack it and then we reverse lunge. Now, very important here to keep the core tight. I can't, I can't say that enough. You don't wanna leak any energy, especially when you have kettlebells racked. The, and so your core needs to be tight so you can get that movement. Of course, with the reverse lunge, we're using the, the front leg and back leg both to power up. Uh, but you wanna be controlled while you're doing this exercise and again, keeping that core tight. The next exercise are renegade rows. So this is, I mean, I love this exercise. It's a tough one. Again, great core exercise, but also of course, because we're rowing, we are using the back. So here again, this is an anti-rotation exercise. So we don't want any rotation or limit that rotation from side to side. So we really got to engage the core and the glutes. Exhale on the way up, pulling back at the hips. As you can see, I'm pulling back in the hips. This is 55 pounds too. So you may be going slow, but again, you're going to feel this in 30 seconds. Your core is really going to feel this because you're engaged throughout the the whole movement. Our next exercise are uh, kettlebell rack squats and alternating press. So again, combining two exercises with the rack squat, core needs to be tight, and then you're just pressing the kettlebell overhead. Again, alternating. So you're going all the way down as far as you can, and then you're blasting up with the heels on the ground, exhaling on the way up, inhaling on the way down. Again, 30 seconds of this, you're really going to start to feel, especially when you're using heavy kettlebells. Our final exercise in this circuit is, I love this one, inside to skier uh, double kettlebell swings. So here we're doing two things here. We're working the posterior chain with the inside kettlebell swings, and then with the skier swings, it's your quads that are doing the work. So as you can see, I have a little bit of a bend. Make sure you bend your knees. What I like to say is quads, glutes as I'm doing this exercise because what that does is it focuses on me using my hips and glutes when the kettlebells are between the legs and using my quads with a little dip when the kettlebells are outside. So again, go really heavy with these. And finally, this is like a burnout. So what I'll do this for two minutes straight, I'll do this exercise, the inside outside kettlebell um, swing again, making sure that I say, you know, inside outside. I'll do five of those. I think I did a little bit more here, but you just do five of these and then you transition right away to five um, deadlift burpees. So you keep doing that for two minutes straight. It's a crazy burnout. And again, it's, uh, it's just a way to burn out uh, using these double kettlebells and really put a finishing touch on your workout. Listen, we're here to build muscle, we're here to burn fat, we're here to get in amazing shape, and these type of workouts will get you there. So there you have it, tough workout. Guys, it looks a lot tougher than it is. Make sure you use challenging weight, okay? So if it's the first time you do it, maybe round one, you go a little bit light, but then round three, uh, two to five, go a little bit heavy. This is all you need, guys. You can end this off with a finisher, but it's a great workout to add to your regime once or twice a week. Get the kettlebell work in. Kettlebells are amazing for full body, uh, full, full body functional movements, athletic, and, and aesthetics. Anyways, 
Guys, click the link on this page to download my free kettlebell for MMA workout program. It's, it doesn't matter if you're a fighter or not, it's just a great workout program and it's free, so download it. Make sure you like this, share this, leave your comments below, and also uh, check out this other kettlebell workout if you like that one. I'm done talking, I gotta go home and sleep, eat and drink my protein. Now it's your turn to get it done.